Can I get closer to it? Oh, I can. I can climb up that thing. I wanna go see! One of them booby traps. Restricted keeper. That sounds exactly like the kind of place I want to go into. Milner Outpost. Clarissa! Where are you? Oh, weren't you scared about the Illuminati or whatever? Wait, Having am I there already? Government? No, yeah, she's in the fort. Meeting about their secret army of Frankensteins? Yes, a little, but the faster we find her, the faster we can leave. Okay, my dial's red now. That must mean I have the ability to tune into something. Oh, shit. Maybe I didn't want to do this. Dinner time! It's never too late to make dessert. Not any... What the hell is this? Do you want to play a game? That's fucking creepy. Alright, I know the answer is no, but we kind of do have to find Clarissa, so let's just ignore the question and thank the weird radio men for the- Wait, seriously? Doors that open themselves have been, like, a really bad thing in my experience. Oh, really? Even automatic doors like in supermarkets? Well, I got my elbow pinched in one of those one time, so yes, even those. And I'm sure it was traumatizing, but we gotta go anyway. Sorry. I wanna go in here first. Oh, what the fuck is that? Firing range. Spooky. Yeah. You ever fired a gun? No. Never really wanted to, either. Yeah, me neither. My grandfather had a... Snub nose centennial, even small, they're heavy. I never liked it. Fort Milner was the home of the U.S. Army Radio Communication School, which saw more than 100,000 students take its curriculum. During the years it was open, the school trained troops from the various armed services in applied oral communication, radio and TV broadcasting, telecommunications, and what was then state-of-the-art techniques in code-breaking using an early form of computer technology. The school was moved to Fort Baxter in Southern California when the post closed in 1974, and it still resides there to this day. Hmm. Fort Alright, so it's locked. I guess that's not where the game of the dude was talking about. Photography prohibited. That is a very serious sign. Restricted. Keep out. Oh, well, they're not messing around. Does the fine print say something about being shot? Yeah, that sign's old. Like, back when we were fighting Nazis old. Still, it's a little disconcerting. Yep. What if they're ghost Nazis? All right, let's go into this door that opened by itself. He asked if I wanted to play a game. I don't know why I'm saying he. It asked if I wanted to play a game. And I'm already playing a game. No, 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 no. Don't be locked. Come on. Well, we didn't really need to go back anyway, right? Unless there's no way out, then yes, we might have. Well, Clarissa got in through some other door, so we should be fine, hypothetically speaking. Uh, speaking of which, she dated Michael? Is that right? It was his life, you know, not mine. He could do whatever he wanted. I didn't mean to put it like- Yeah, yeah, I got it. I mean, was he the type of guy that would go for that, like, sort of thing? I'm just trying- Well, you know, you'd have to ask him what he was into, I guess. 
I mean, just from what I've heard of him, like that one story about the cops just straight buying him a beer? Just what would a guy like that see in her? Like, at least at the start. There must have been something, right? Right. It's not a trick question, Jonas. She's been the homecoming queen every year since she grew boobs. And he'd been the captain of every sports team he'd ever played on. It was practically an arranged marriage. Huh. Okay. It's... Ah, can you imagine sleeping here? I'm trying not to. But why would the construction guys leave the bed oh, for Oh, Jesus. It seems kind of... I don't know. Kind of morbid. Yeah, it's... It's just strange to see it like this. It's got a padlock. You can't pick this one, can you? No. We need, like, bolt cutters or something. Or the code. Oh, we could find the code. Oh, shit. Hey, that's... Clarissa! Clarissa, hold up! What the fuck? Jonas, what happened? Are you alright? Jonas, are you okay in there? Ah. All right. Spoopy time, I guess. Oh, Jesus Christ. Testing, testing. Um, okay. I can't... I can't hear anything outside at all, but luckily this radio thing's working. Look, whatever. Clarissa's not in here, and it's just a room, so like, riddle me that, first of all, and then second of all, I can't get out. Uh, yeah. Hold on. I'll check. I, I can't hear anything outside at all, but there's just a really Oh, weird... Jesus Christ. Hello? Are you... Look, is someone there? When the time comes, let Jonas talk to his mom. What is this? What is this? What does oh, this mean? Oh my god. Who are you? What the fuck? Ow. I'm okay. Okay, what just happened? Cause that, that sucked. Uh, Clarissa ran in there, disappeared into the walls, yeah, and- Yeah, I'm not really one to hate stuff, but I hated all of that. Is this what you were talking to me on? Yep. Old girl did the trick. You think maybe, uh, Clarissa was using this before? You know, to call us and everything? It was locked, remember? How could she have gotten in? Same way I did. But then I don't really know how she could have gotten out. Hmm. Oh, here's the code for the, uh, for the padlock. 3418. It's on a list of... Huh. They call codes cookies. Is that slang or something? I don't know, but we got the combo. So, Three, great. Four, hey, did I... Did, did you see that? In... In the mirror? The reflection... Was weird. Uh, don't think I'm nuts or anything, but my reflection kind of gave me, like, fatherly advice that made absolutely no sense when you were stuck just now. So... What? Okay. Make it snappy. Get it? I'm choosing <laughs> not to get it. Alright. It's weird that they don't, like, let you in on... ...any of the... ...moments or triggers to interrupt things. Radio locks. <laughs> the technology here has always been... It's like primitive and from the future. Yeah, no, it's something. Okay, no more spooky shit. Let me get out of here. Three, four, eighteen. Three... Oh, I don't even have to remember it. Oh Jesus. What was that? I don't know. Okay, just making sure. <sighs> I'm just gonna pretend it didn't happen, so let's just carry on. Or we can go back and look. 
see if anything changed. Okay, nothing in the mirror. And there's nothing in here. Okay. This is really creeping me out. Let's get out of the facilities. Oh, shit. There's a ghost in the background of that picture. Wait, if he's taking the picture on his cell phone, why is it on an negative like that maybe it's a dope filter also what are these ghosts they're huge oh I'm gonna hate to go out in that so actually, um, before we press on, I've had to go pee for like a while now, so since we're stuck anyway, I thought I'd, you know... Oh my god, go in the corner then. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I know this is like way too much too soon for us right now, but I'm gonna totally explode. I'll force it out fast. I cannot at all believe you right now. Don't look at me! Be quieter. It's like oh, louder shit. than the rainstorm. I know the uh, acoustics are really carrying it. Sorry. Oh my god. That scared the shit out of me. Clarissa! Okay, that was definitely her. What is she? Is this just like a <sighs> game to her or something? She knows it's us. I don't think she'd be freaking out like this if she wasn't, like, in trouble or something. You know, it just occurred to me she could also be having, like, a Ren episode. A Renisode. Possessed or whatever we want to call it. But Ren, Ren acted like he was underwater. The guy could barely move. Yeah, well, that's true. Hello? Is this thing, is this, God, is this, is this going out or, wait, I can, oh, I can hear myself, that's oh, not, Oh, man, maybe God, she didn't see us, anybody... I don't know, but whatever, she still has a radio, so we still gotta get to her. I saw you walk behind me, and that was just rude. Fine. I'll work on my scare tactics. Please don't. <laughs> Every individual it has maintained is enveloped in a radium, invisible to the carnal eye, and only perceived by the soul accustomed to it. Yeah, okay. Okay, I can't go out that way. Let's go into creepy building number three. Oh shit. Handprints, really? The handprints are a macabre touch. Do you know who did that? Please tell me it's like a known thing teenagers here do or something. I really have no idea. Well, you really couldn't just say your friends do this for my own peace of mind? No. Oh, fuck. What was that? You... you heard that, right? Something just fell. Relax. I'm sure a bird landed on a piece of loose masonry or something. The lights are right again. Fuck. Okay, let's do this radio thing. In the Cascade Mountains of Washington, the Navy opens the world's largest radio transmitter. Its one million watts can flash a message around the world in a tenth of a second. Hey kids, wanna play a game? Ah. Ah. What? Oh my god, Hangman? Hangman? 
Be sharp and listen, mister. That's fucking terrible. This is going to tell the classification board a lot about what can be expected of you in the future. How many questions will you be able to get in the allotted time? Like a test? Uh this this isn't how you play hangman. Here's a simple one to start. So don't hold your breath. What is the name of the school you are standing in? School Ten. we're standing in? Isn't this Nine. like a classroom? Eight. I, I thought it was just like a, a fort. Seven. U.S. Army Radio Communication School. That's the oh stuff, Charlie. Now you're swinging. It all goes into your final rating. You want to get a good rating, don't you? You want to be a good soldier? Why the hell would we want to be a good soldier? Yeah, sure. If that's... That's what you want. Excellent. Ah. Oh, Jesus. What is going on? Ugh, I feel like I'm stuck on a tilt-a-whirl. Just keep the pointer on the button. I'm upside Question down. Question two. What did the communications officers at Fort Milner call codes? Cookies. Who would know that? This isn't World War II. You call codes cookies? There. Now you're cooking. This is radio fucking trippy. Have an important job, and you wouldn't want them to be unqualified. Uh, no. I mean, like any job, right? Like anything, right? We are an what? Race. And through all our times, the sea has ruled our breaks. But be wary, young ones. Jonas, what the hell are you talking about? One last round and you've cleared your uh. exam. Pencils ready. How many officers died in the sinking of the USS Canaloa? Oh shit, I don't know. Ten. The other ships, and other ships Nine. To sail them. Above all Eight. victories, beyond all loss. Seven. In spite of changing values in the changing world. Five. Fifty-three? Uh-oh. You're off, Bob. That's not gonna cut it. Ninety-seven brave men and women died on the USS Canaloa. Eighty-five officers, twelve passengers. It oh, all adds up shit. to another fact for the classification board. Just another fact among many. I am. I didn't need to get that far. Jonah, no. State submarine Canaloa is shown for the first time in Pacific waters patrolling for the enemy. Pacific waters patrolling for the enemy. Through the periscope, the commander looks out over the ocean's surface. Canaloa was lost today, lost at sea near. Why are you here? Was it something we? What a question. Never left. What? What? What do you want? For the first time. For the first time. For the first ah. time. Time. Just time. What? I. That was not fun. Just take it slow and easy. You've just had. An experience. Yes, yes, very good. This has been United News, and thank you for listening.
This is just unbelievable. Anyone? Can anyone just... That's gotta be Clarissa. Let's get her and get out of here. Or use her radio and get out of here, but let's just get out of here. Oh my god. Okay. Whew. I wonder what would have happened if I got all those questions right. Clarissa's asleep right now. What? Be still so as not to wake her. Um... Uh, huh? Cross your fingers. Uh, Clarissa! Oh, well look at this. The super twins decided to grace me with their presence. I thought maybe I wasn't good enough for a house call. Um... Are you all right? I mean, yeah. Why? Yeah, sure, my hair might be a little weird, but there's not a lot I can do about that. You just sounded really distressed, that's all. Well, I mean, I don't know. I'm fine now, so... All right, where's this famous radio? I don't know, I can't get it to do anything I want. Alex, want to take a look at this? Yeah, no, this is... This is like a low frequency thing. It, it's just meant for the base. It won't. I don't think it can beam out. <sighs> really? No, no, no. Isn't there a way? Our officers who know your problems for and well will give you a friendly and sympathetic hearing. Who is that? Cross your fingers. Jonas, wait. We're in another. Oh fuck! Clarissa, is there anything like? Can we cut her down with something? <sighs> Holy crap. What is it? Is something wrong, Clarissa? I would have swore she was in here. Better gone than dead. Oh, maybe this was the, the thing, the radio she was using. If we can get it to... I mean, she got it to kinda work, so... Yeah, it it only broadcasts within, the, within a short oh, space. Man. It's not gonna do what we need it to. Really? How do you know? Jonas, we're in a loop. We already... just... it's okay. Knock yourself out. Clarissa! Clarissa, it's us. It's Alex. Are you okay? Alex. What the fuck? She's like... I never forget she's that like I Reynolds. am an American. Clarissa! There will be other ships and other souls to sail them. What? No! Oh my god! Why would she do that? Holy shit! Why would she do that? We're, we're, we're not. It's not like we're. She. She was. She was like possessed. I. I, I just. I, I just. Uh, this is. Jonas, this is so horrible. I don't. I don't even know what to. We... We should get to the others. I... I... Can't even imagine telling them. Or... Or how to tell them. I mean... We'll... We'll figure it out. This is unbelievable. Wait, where did she wow. go? Um, there's no way she got up from that, right? Like, there's no way. We both saw what happened. That was... Wait, she... she's... Uh... I can't think of the appropriate word here. Dead? The word is dead. She should be dead, Alex. I watched her. There was no breaking that fall, so... How'd she walk away? This... is impossible. Cause... unless she's built of rubber... Hallucination? Dual hysteria? I, I don't... I don't know, Jonas. Well, regardless... Good news? Yes! Jonas, of course it's good news that Clarissa isn't dead. Christ! That's not why I hesitated. Of course it's good news if she's not dead. I'm just saying if. Well, she's not dead, Jonas. We can, I think, make at least a stand on that. All I'm saying is we don't know a whole lot of anything right now. Can I just leave now? Okay.
That was that was a lot. It might have been a hallucination. But the, the ghost that was or the spirit that was possessing Ren said that they can't hurt us. Let's just get back to Ren at the comm tower. Maybe he's had better luck than us at anything. Alright, yeah, I know where it is. Let's just go. <sighs> Maybe she went to the comm tower? I don't know anymore. I didn't realize how fucking creepy this game was going to be. Let's talk to Ren and Nona before we try and find her, cause, but I don't know, maybe they know something we don't. Alright, let's go. She didn't hobble over to the co comms tower. Hey, hey, I, I saw you guys coming up from the tower, the Dick Tower. I think you mean Harden Tower. Please don't ruin that for me. It's all I have left. Anything uh, good to report besides that you're still alive? Which I'm glad. You know, don't get me wrong. Thanks. Um, yes, I am still alive. But uh, no. Other than okay. that, no. Any luck contacting somebody? Nope. No luck to speak of. And honestly, I thought this week was going to be a big karma dump. Well, we're all here now. Well, I mean, except Clarissa, but we're mostly all here and we'll come up with something. I hope so. This stupid radio has been what my therapist would call a negative reinforcer. <laughs> Just won't work right. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. What? It's kind of, you know, it's just about to start doing its thing. We, Ren, we need you sober Jeez. right now. We need you capable. At how can Taking you be so drugs. stupid? Wait, you're not messing with us? You seriously took another one? It was like, it was like half of one, alright? It's just to level me out. It'll, it'll bring me back up. That's what it does. If you're down, it brings you up. You better pray to whatever God scares you the most. It does level you out, because if this screws us up, you're on summary probation. This thing doesn't work. Not getting anything? I'm getting something, but it's like, I don't know. Hey, Nona. Night's still going, huh? We heard you on the uh, speaker system. You got that working? That's about all I got working. Uh, sorry I was like, weird earlier. But, hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You have to know something. You've been like, out there. Uh, yeah, we have. It's been ghosts. Nona, ghosts are going on. The blackouts, the hallucinations, it's all been ghosts. Ghosts? Really? Yeah, and it would really help if you could just jump to the believing us part. It would save a headache. Oh! Oh, I got it! This is great! This is perfect! I know exactly what to do! Do you? Yeah, totally! It's Maggie Adler! Maggie Adler? Yeah! She has a boat! Had a boat. I mean, the boat's still here, but she's not. She's dead. Her house... manor, or whatever it is, is behind a huge gate. You can see it coming up here from Main Street. No, I know! But the keys to it are here, somewhat... What? Readily available. My sister, Allie, worked at the parks office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, no, gonna... no, we are not. We are not going to go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident, Burnout. Hey, come on. I'm not a burnout. Well, I mean, Jonas kind of does have a point here. Like, do you know there's a boat? Or is this like when you knew the teachers <sighs> kept liquor in the lounge? <laughs> come on. 
I was like 13 when I thought they all got drunk at lunch. This is a real thing. There's a boat at her dock. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you want us to trust you when things are really bad? You had Alex bring the radio. You brought us here. Come on, Jonas, this is nobody's fault. Ghosts are never anybody's fault, certainly not ours. Yeah, guys, this isn't really a production. Thanks, Nona. It should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got going on out of whack. I mean, we all grew up with each other. Alex knows she can trust me. Guys, you know there's no television cameras here, right? Take the energy down a notch. Alex, I am not putting my life in his hands. This whole thing has been a complete joke to this guy. I, I can't believe you're even kind of defending him. Jonas. I know you said Ren is like harmless or whatever, but I'm over giving him passes. And you should be too. I don't need a pass from you. Alex is my best friend. Yeah, and she could hardly muster two- Guys, stop it. Stop. The collective neuroses call a truce, okay? Yes, please. Look, I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. <laughs> there what is, is a that? boat at Maggie Adler's house. And the key to her house is back Let's on go get Main it. Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Yeah, it's not like... You know... I'm fine. Whatever, I'm ready. She shouldn't... You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my... Like, brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is gonna start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. You- Just shut God. up. Both of you. Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night- Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of. Keeping in mind who's taller, who do you want coming with you? Yeah, your oldest pal. Nona? Wanna come with me? What? Really? I mean, I guess. Why this are you isn't, making me shack up with this guy? It's my friggin' been plan. Together. Be quiet. Both of you. God, you're like puppies. You're not gonna die if I go to the grocery store for ten minutes. This is a total punt, Alex. Yeah, this no, is it's fine. This will be a good... If you don't want to take sides, don't take sides. But no, nobody's happy with this. Uh. Yeah, well, I don't really care right now what you're happy with. See you soon. <sighs> okay.